Shion. Surely, you must have known that this was going to happen. Why would I know? Because in your memory, you've been to a number of worlds before you came to this one. And, and of, course, of course, in those worlds, the only beings you met were the Dark Dark. Dark. That's, that's all that's all left in your heart. The Dark Darkest uh, Memories. Uh, your, your memories are long, long gone. gone. Uh, every uh, one. That's, that's a lie. I remember I everyone from the islands. islands. They're, They're my, 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 my closest friends. friends. And who threw away those friends? Maybe, Maybe it's, your friends. Friends. Maybe it's your own actions, actions you've forgotten. It was you who destroyed your home. Here for So we meet again. You made me a promise. I remember. It was to look after Sora. I'm sorry. I'm not sure I've kept that promise very well. Can you tell me what's happening? Some of Sora's memories are missing. How could that be? Sora's memories are escaping through Sora's nobody into a third person. And now, they're starting to become a part of her. Isn't there a way to bring back just Sora's memories? If they're still separate, then I think I can take out fragments of it. But, if her memories, and Sora's memory fragments, are completely weaved together, I would need to untangle them from each other, and that would take more time. Which means, it would take even longer, before Sora can wake up again. And Diz wouldn't tolerate that. So what can you do? If I just jump in, and rearrange her memory, then Sora might wake up, only to find out that nobody remembers him anymore. That's a risk. I just can't take. It's too late either way. Sora's awakening has already been delayed. Sora's nobody, and the one that's absorbing his memory. None of us imagined that they would fight so hard to become their own people. Unfortunately, the only real solution is for them both to go away. Did you know, her face was blank at first. But now, there is a face that is clearly visible. I think that's proof that she has entered Sora's memories. Sora's memories? Sora's nobody's memories, and her memories. They're all a jumbled mess now, and to put them back into one... I'm afraid there's no other way. All right. Is it that I'm not supposed to exist? Well, what do you want to do? 
Xion? I want... I want to be... with you two. Then come back with us. I can't. Not the way I am now. But... what would it take for me to be like you? Hey, it's been a while. You think so? So, I went to the beach today. And there was this girl who looked kind of like Shion. But I couldn't get close enough to tell for sure. I probably imagined it. To be honest, I'm not even sure today's mission really happened. Feels like I just woke up from a dream or something. Do you remember our promise? When we said that the three of us would go to the beach on our next break? Maybe that's why. Maybe I saw Shion there because I wanted her to be there. Want to go look for her? Huh? Beginning tomorrow, let's use our spare time to find Shion. Mm hmm. Sounds good. Let's do that. It's no use. You sure you're not forgetting someplace? I've been everywhere I know how to get to. All right. <sighs> the only place I haven't been to is Castle Oblivion. <gasps> it was just the other day that Shion was asking me what the place was like. And the day before she disappeared, you said she was put on an important mission, remember? Yeah, but there's nothing there anymore. Well, Shion might be there. Mm. <sighs> Apparently, Shion comes from Castle Oblivion. What? And that's probably why she was asking about the place. I had no idea. Me neither. I only found out a little while ago. Castle Oblivion. Shion. So, this is Castle Oblivion. Roxas? Oh, my... My head... 
Easy, man. Let's retreat for now and- I'm fine! We have to find Shion. Uh, uh. What's happening? Uh. Roxas! So much... Rushing into... My head... Let's get out of here, for now. No, wait. There's... Something... I can... Almost... Giving up already? I thought you were stronger than that. Riku! Are you all right? What happened to me? You collapsed just as you entered the castle doors. Don't you remember? I only remember going inside. Just take it easy for now. I'm fine. Let's go back to Castle Oblivion. Don't push yourself, man. Who's there? Shion? Shion! Wait! Out of the way! Hey! Roxas! Wait! I thought the imposter was sighted in Castle Oblivion. Shion. No way that was Shion. The one who ran away first was Shion. But why run? You want to go back? Huh. Shion. Where have you been? Axel and I have been looking all over for you. You have? Sorry. Let's go home. If you come back voluntarily, Syx will let all this drop. He has to. I don't care what he said to you. I'll be there. Me and Axel will make sure... <sighs> I really can't. Why not? Come on! Wait! <laughs> well, hello there, Shion. Axel? No, wait! Stop! Shion! You're sure things are better this way? I never expected you to question it. 
If you could save one of them, why would you choose the puppet? <clears throat> or put it this way, which would you rather suffer the loss of? Some make-believe friendship? Or a real one? <clears throat> Things are finally right again. Of course we're better off this way. Xemnas is exasperated from all the fixing we've had to do. We have to set things right. There's simply too much on the line. Lee. I need to know. About what? Shion. Tell me what happened to her. Shion is a valued member of the organization, but she needs her rest. So worry not. Sora. The connection. Connection? He is what makes you and Shion a part of each other's lives. And the reason I placed Shion among our number. If you want her to stay that way, I must insist. You get your mind off these needless distractions. I will have Shion return to her duties tomorrow. Today, you must focus on yours. Understood. Oh. Oh. Hey, Roxas. Are you certain we've taken suitable measures with Shion and Roxas? I will admit, Shion has strayed from our original designs. However, we are also seeing an interesting side effect. Really? The key. Shion was affected by Roxas, just as we had anticipated. This was indeed what we had hoped to achieve. But then, through Roxas, Sora himself began to shape it into her, giving Shion a sense of identity. Our plan seemed like a failure at this point. But then it occurred to me, Shion is keeping Sora's memories trapped by claiming them as her own. Keeping her close to Roxas will ultimately prevent Sora from ever waking. I see. And what of the imposter? See that he stays away from Roxas. He is merely an impurity that would make Shion's existence incomplete. Then we shall return to our original plan. What am I supposed to do, Riku?
Oh no. What has happened? Sora's memory. I'm afraid it stopped. What does that mean? Unless something is done, he'll never wake from his slumber. The gloves must come off, then. But... Nobody's never should have existed. As I'm sure you understand, Namine. Yes. Is this? Are you really okay? <laughs> this is getting weird. Huh? Since when do you ever worry about me? What do you mean, weird? Usually I do all the worrying over you. I don't think it's ever been the other way around before. Just feels strange, that's all. Roxas, of course I worry about you. I'm just glad you're back, Shion. Even though it might have been rough on you. Is Axel coming today? Ah, uh, who knows? You didn't fight, did you? How could he? How could that jerk attack you like that? That jerk? Do you mean Axel? But... I wouldn't be sitting here with you if Axel hadn't done that. He's your best friend. I know, but so are you! <laughs> it's just not the same without all three of us. Axel! Huh? You need something? Well, um... Something's wrong with Roxas. You don't know why, do you? He says the Keyblade wears him out when he goes to use it. And then today, I was fighting the same way Roxas does. You would know more about Roxas than I do by now. What do you mean? <sighs> well... What do you think, Shion? I'm not sure. Not sure, huh? Is that because you're a puppet? <gasps> you do know that. You're a replica, whose original purpose was to copy Roxas's powers. So if you see Roxas's powers getting weaker, 
while your powers are getting stronger, it could be that you're robbing Roxas of his powers more than you ought to be. What can I... Then what should I do? You gotta think for yourself. Cause I know you're not just a puppet. We're best friends. You, me, and Roxas, that is. Got it memorized? Sure. Can I ask you just one other thing? What's that? I saw a boy today who looks just like Roxas. <sighs> is he... who I think he is? Sora has a pretty powerful effect on her, is all I'm saying. Yes. It was not supposed to gain a mind of its own, nor become the person we see. But in the end, it only proves that the puppet is the more worthy vessel. The time has come. Syx. Are the devices ready? In a matter of days. Good. And what of Roxas? Both of them have connections to Sora, but we only need one of them under our thumb. Whether Shion takes from Roxas the rest of what he has to give, or whether he destroys her first and takes back what is his, there is no change to our plans. No matter how, Sora's power will belong to us. Alright guys, looks like we're coming close to the end. Guys, thank you so much for watching my gameplay, where well, it's not really even gameplay, it's more of a story for this game that's doing it for us. But I'll see you guys in the next one. Until then, laters.